Another day, another story, FMECA, Famica, Analysis Simplified. Hello everyone. Welcome to today's session where we'll be focusing on applying FMECA analysis to stormwater assets. If you're keen on protecting your community and your assets, you're in the right place. Introduction to Stormwater Assets Let's start with the basics. Stormwater assets are the infrastructure designed to manage rainwater runoff. We're talking about gutters, swales, drains, pipes, pits, open channels, and detention basins. Often overlooked, but oh so important. Next, what is FMECA? It's an acronym that stands for Failure Modes, Effects, and Criticality Analysis. Think of it as a health checkup for your stormwater assets. Why should you care about applying FMECA to stormwater assets? These systems are susceptible to blockages, overflows, and general wear and tear. FMECA helps you create a proactive rather than a reactive maintenance plan. The FMECA process. The FMECA process consists of three main steps, identifying failure modes, analyzing their effects, and then evaluate their criticality. Let's explore these steps one by one. Step one, identifying failure modes. Here, you brainstorm all the ways a stormwater asset could fail. For instance, a drain could get clogged with leaves or sediment. Step two, analyzing effects. For each failure mode, list down the consequences. A clogged drain, for example, could lead to localized flooding. Step 3. Evaluating criticality. This involves ranking how urgent or dangerous each failure mode could be. For example, a clog near a busy intersection is more critical than one in a less busy area. Let's make this more tangible with a real-world example. There is a retarding basin located upstream of a residential area. In this example, a significant failure mode could be leakage through the basin wall. The effects of such a failure mode would reduce water holding capacity, leading to potential downstream flooding in the residential area, especially during heavy rainfall. Evaluating its criticality, we find that this is an extremely high criticality scenario. This basin serves a residential area, making any failure potentially life-threatening. So, armed with this FMECA analysis, we would prioritize regular inspections for leaks and perhaps even install real-time water level sensors. Conclusion. To wrap it all up, FMECA gives us a structured, informed approach to managing stormwater assets. It helps you be proactive, saving lives and resources. Q&A and sign off. Got questions or thoughts? Feel free to drop them in the comments below. Until our next chat, stay dry and stay safe. Thanks for watching. Odysseus IMC Pty Limited call Sandy Muir. Phone plus 613810370111 SM at odysseusimc.com.au